Hey y'all, thanks for watching Didi Croy with My Favorite Groomer. So today we're gonna groom Coco. She gets a 10 all over, basically head to toe. This is mom's preference and I see them about every two to three months for grooming and they are booked for the year. She's been our demo dog for the dog up stand and the dog up mini because she loves to sit down. So I know her very well. She's super kind. Uh, she does have the cherry eye, we call it. And we've done a video on that, so you guys can go watch that if you're interested in watching that. Uh, I am going to be doing our demo on the Bravura. And the Bravura Lithium Clipper is a wall brand. And it does say on the blade, made in Germany. It does say on the clipper, made in Hungary. So that's kind of who we're supporting there. It is a great lightweight, to me, like nicely lightweight. Not like some of those heavier cordless clippers. Uh, I'm interested in seeing how long it'll last me grooming her completely straight through. Uh, there's some blades. See, this, so the thing is, is I couldn't just use this, this clipper because some other things I'd like to do, I might not be able to do with this clipper. But it will go from a nine blade, 10 blade, 15 blade, 30 blade, and 40 blade. Let me double check. Yeah, so that's what we got here on the package. So all the way down is gonna be your nine. It's gonna come up to a 10, and then it's gonna to go to 15, 30, and then 40, okay? So that's kind of cool to me, but at the same time, the, the lifespan on this clipper may not be able to keep up with me. It has a uh, limited one-year warranty, 30-day satisfaction guarantee, so if you purchase a product from somebody, if you have an issue, you contact the company directly that manufactured it. In this case, the phone number here on the box or the website. All right, so it's really comparable to my Andis 5-speed, except for it doesn't have a cord on it. You're supposed to use it as a rechargeable. I have been told by the distributor that I purchased through that uh, this has a lot of um, shorter life span than some of the other clippers and that the five in one blade, which is like costly, when it starts to go out, you basically just replace it. You don't go get it sharpened, okay? So that's some things to keep in mind as you use a Bravura, that you may have to replace the blade and replace it often. So why not, when you make your first order, go ahead and buy the blade, buy an extra blade? It's a five in one fine blade and it's a powerful rotary motor cord cordless clipper. So there is a cord, it sounds like, that came with it. So I have that somewhere. And I guess I could use it as a corded once it runs out of battery. It has about 90 minutes of lithium ion battery power. So you know with a long day of grooming, this probably wouldn't help hold to it. So then I'm turning it right back into a cord or I'm just using it intermittently. And sometimes I don't personally feel like that's healthy for a battery, but there's only one way to find out, right? So we're gonna get started. Right, Coco? All right, let's do this. Here we go. We're gonna get down to our 10 blade, which is nine, 10, and here we go. Let's get started here. Hey, <laughs> you're so cute. Super early this morning. It's about 7:58, maybe 8 o'clock already. Just this feel odd to me that. Yeah, that looks like a ten blade. <laughs> this feels really odd. It's a uh, really lightweight, which is what you want, right? It's like getting used to anything. I'm gonna watch these moles here.
It's uh, getting some used to because it's lighter than the Andes five speed. It feels like I have to really get the, the scale out to do the numbers, but without the cord kind of pulling at you as well, it does make it for a uh, a different feel. So I'm trying to kind of feel out feel out the clipper themselves. I do like where the power button is. So I can put my thumb on it pretty quickly. I'll just leave you guys right here. What I'll probably do. Still cool. I think I'm hesitating just a tad bit because it does feel pretty sharp, but truly I could be going a little faster here. Sorry, Coco, I'm going to move you. I can't seem to get around this. I wonder if it... So do everything you need to do before you go get your next instrument, which I'm going to use the dog up stand on her. And so I'm going to do the seven down her leg so they're not so bony, right? So that's kind of a downfall for me. I get used to the power button on this. The downfall on that is, hey, cutie pie. And it just seems like it might be um, just a tad bit slower on the motor than uh, what I'm used to. So I, th I light light wise, I can go pretty fast, but I feel like. Uh, cut, the hair cutting speed is slower. I have to double check that comparable. All right, so now I'm going to put it, this is what I think I normally have to do, put it back on the charger and come over here and get my, well, let's just double check. It's a wall, right? So I'm going to pull, bust out my wall and uh, my, these are wall or master, they're made almost identical. This is not designed for a guard. Does not have the grooves back here for it. It's not designed for this guard, not the ones I normally use. So now, okay, it does have guard sets here that came with it. Not my favorite kind of thing because uh, they're plastic, so they're really movable, but it is a heavy plastic. So let's try to do what I normally would do here is come back with the, with this like reverse or down. So we're going to go reverse to get that just hair getting right in there. Yeah, I think they definitely cut um, less fast or cut slower because I can hear that it kind of feels, you know, it sounds bogged down, right? Just not what I'm used to here. It could definitely be handy though. If you're mobile grooming, I, I don't recognize that I would love it because I 
on and off, the trailer is on and off, on and off. I don't know how well my these would hang in there. Look that way, sweetie. Barely wanting to get anything through that. Right there. Let me see this way, please. Mm, Coco just hanging in there. She's just hanging in there. I want to keep pushing this power but this uh, battery level as the power. Should put the power button there. I don't know. <laughs> okay, now we got to get our seven blade. Because I don't want to make her feet look too bony, so I'm going to go ahead and switch it up to a 7. And now, because I can't do a 7 on that, I have to get my Andis 5 speed back out. And let's go ahead and get her up on the Dog Up Stand Mini. I'm oh, sorry, excuse me, Dog Up Mini. Go ahead and stand up now. So I did everything I need to do there, and I'll come back, sort of. i got to come back and do her legs, but also... So this is definitely slowing me down because I've got to come redo stuff instead of just keep going. I mean, she's still going to have a shave down, but uh, the legs are just less bony and very similar to the rest of the body. You can hardly, hardly tell. There is a slight difference, but you can hardly tell. So that way the top of her feet are not extremely bony like the one the tank. However, there's some areas I gotta come back to here because she was sitting down the whole time. I'm gonna focus here until I get my tin blade back. Get your tin blade back on. And I'm just going to stay here, man, because I can just get all the work done here. Instead of going back and forth, two different clippers and all this and that. We're all different, man.
It's barely warm, but since I'm going to go to the face, I'm going to start a new one here. Because of this cherry eye, I'm going to go ahead, like usual, take it down real close here. It's just going to leak until I see her again. And then we'll get all this washed out real well in the tub. I'm going to put my four guard on. It says sometimes purple or also known as one fourth inch. Gosh, I should have that memorized already, but all these years, I probably have it memorized in my head, but when you're working, you just, you just know what you need to use and you just use it. And because of all this uh, yellow, uh, red um, just staining, I'm going to use a 7. Come down with a 7 down her chin, take all that out. You see, babies. We're just about ready to go to the bath, but I am curious on the, okay, well, I did that all wrong, on the, oh, yeah, pull it forward, 40 of the aspect, 40 aspect of the Bravura. So let's try this real fast on the 40. Let me sweep this a little bit so you guys can kind of see real close how much I get off. I get a better idea. I need to hustle up though, let me tell you that. Okay, we've got a, my 40 here. Well, that's pretty nice, man. Real matted in there. Real red too. Like she's been chewing at it a lot. She smells like she needs to use the bathroom. Okay. Back on the charger. And let's get you up one more time here. Do your, do your nails real fast. Not too much to take off there. Hey, 
You're such a good girl. Can you see this one? You okay? Move forward, sweetie. Move forward. All right, so we did a nail trim and all that. We're going to go to the bath and come back and wrap it up.